This country is expected to receive a substantial shipment of COVID-19 Sinopharm vaccines from China next week. This was announced by Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley, who says it would allow Trinidad and Tobago to fast-track its vaccination program. Health Minister Terence de Alsing said the ministry has a plan to vaccinate 300,000 people from various sectors in the shortest possible time and is also adding six new mass vaccination sites to do so. Dr. Rowley noted the substantial supply of vaccines from China would allow such an exercise to be undertaken and would make a huge dent in this country's vaccination program. Vaccines should arrive here next week, which will allow the Minister of Health to do what he said there. Vaccines will be available to do the program that the Minister outlined. The Prime Minister added that the shipment of vaccines from the African Medical Supply Platform would also be arriving earlier than expected. First shipment to CARICOM would be here not in August but in July. So in, towards the middle of July we expect to get our first shipment, CARICOM, approximately 800,000 doses coming in. And of that 800,000 doses, Trinidad and Tobago is expected to get just under 200,000 of it. And we expect to get another 400,000 in August and another 500,000 in September for CARICOM. The COVAX facility, Dr. Rowley said the third shipment of vaccines that were expected on July 14th have now been delayed to August. He added that conversations with the United States have progressed with regards to a vaccine shipment but indicated that there's been no signed documentation or order to release any vaccines at this point in time.